Before the destruction of the Earth, human beings sent millions of audiovisual radio waves called frequency documents into space to help preserve the planet's history. Due to the lack of time, they had to compile these documents, and since they could only hold a certain amount of memory on the unit, each different frequency document had a single subject to explain within it. The document contained short videos, text, and photographs of the subject. Whoever received a frequency document would learn of its specific contents. One particular planet called Fertiones received the frequency document explaining the desert plant cactus. Since the inhabitants of Fertiones were the only forms of intelligent life in our galaxy, their understanding of the contents was possible and no translation was needed. The frequency document was reviewed and processed by the head aliens at Frodiones. The formal agreement was to organize a suitable video presentation to show the inhabitants the new findings of its species discovered. The video would play at a location called San Sector 5. The location was set to fit the context of the film. The video would play in plain English to capture the content's pure form. All our human species can show for itself is this single frequency document, since most others have gotten lost in deep space. In short, it's a bummer. So, enjoy this front row seat to the live event at Sand Sector 5. This experience is brought to you and made possible by the Laser Emporium Projector 2000. A cactus is a succulent zero type. A what? You think? I said a succulent zero type. This means that this strange plant receives all its nutrients and necessary things to survive by storing large quantities of the chemical H2O in its roots, stems, or leaves. This is an evolutionary adaptation to the plant due to its geographical location, which was mostly large sand trodden areas like our very own Sand Sector 5. Also, flowers of assorted shapes and colors would come to blossom depending on whether the star the humans call the sun was in the cactus's immediate atmosphere. Concluded after further investigation, we discovered numerous sharp angle points on the cactus that are said to cause a damage in one's health if by chance felt with a sense of touch. Are these sharp angle points of prey? Or sharp angle points of love? But, my comrades, the cactus has other interesting facts about it other than what I have just explained to you. It seems that this succulent zero type has a tremendous story in the planet Earth history books. The indigenous humans that lived in southern Earth used to ingest their cacti to reach different levels of enlightenment within the tribe's spiritual belief system. The ingestee would experience divine hallucinations and second sight. One particular group of historical indigenous humans named their most powerful city after this very plant called Tenochtitlan, meaning Place of the Sacred Cactus. In honor of our new findings of the cactus frequency, here at Planet Fordiones, we shall now call Sand Sector 5 Tenochtitlan, the Place of the Sacred Cactus Frequency Document. Thank you, Planet Earth.